I love her to death because she's all I have, you know? I'm sorry. <laughs> Lakeisha Davis tears up as she talks about her worries about her four-year-old daughter getting the flu. So I don't want her to get it. That scares me a lot. <laughs> it scares me. So she's come to the Whittier Street Health Center to get a flu shot. City officials say locally there have been about 700 confirmed cases of the flu so far this season, compared with 70 of all of last season. According to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, 29 states are reporting high levels of influenza-like illness. The volume that we're seeing in, in influenza this year has really outpaced the previous years that we've been tracking. Nationally, health officials are urging people to sign in and get vaccinated. Honestly, until I guess it hits your own family, you probably don't realize that, you know, you, maybe you always think that, well, I've never gotten it before, I'm immune to it, or I'm not going to get it in the future. Um, it's, it's, uh, it's those kind of uh, thought processes that I think allow people to uh, not get the flu vaccine and, and then succumb to it. While the CDC does not keep tabs of deaths overall from the flu, it's estimated that 24,000 Americans die from it each year. Ross Simpson, The Associated Press.